that shield like all right not be let's uh let's get it switched on over grand theft auto san andreas man let's go <laughs> i this is one of my favorite grand theft autos growing up although fun fact i've never beaten a single grand theft auto game ever at all <laughs> i've beaten uh saints row one or two or something like that so that's like a, a gta like game right but <laughs> that's it I've never, I've never beaten any actual Grand Theft Auto game. One of these days. One of these days I certainly will. And I'm hoping it'll let us into the option menu before we get into the game, but I don't think it does. I think it's going to throw us right in. Yeah, it's throwing us right in. So, I'll turn the audio on, but it's going to have to be low, low, until we can see about muting the music or whatever. After five years on the East Coast, well, actually... It's time to go home. The music should only really be a thing whenever we're driving around, right? Oh, you know what? We need to do one other thing. We need to turn this on to a mature stream because GTA is a little bit mature. It's not like super bad in my opinion, but uh, my opinion doesn't mean much in this case. <laughs> I mean, I know I was playing these games when I was awfully young, but I mean, whether that's a good thing or not, who knows. Also, I just realized Everything refreshed when I switch scenes for some reason. That's all right. I don't remember this game starting up so slow. Hey, that's my paper, man. That's money. This is drug money. It's my money, man. Hey, don't worry about it. I'll fill it out later. <sighs> Welcome home, Carl. Glad to be back. You haven't forgotten about us, have you, boy? Hell no, Officer Tampenny. I was just wondering what took you all so long. Get in the car. Ease up, man. Damn. Watch your head. Ah. Oh, my bad. <laughs> Get out of here, you greaseball bastard. Stupid Mexican. Oh, hey, sorry. My bad. Hey, man, my bad. All right, nice little cutscene in the beginning. Introduce us and uh, I guess our struggles here in <laughs> San Andreas. How you been, Carl? How's your wonderful family? Is that my mom. You know what's his name? Yeah, I guess I do. Samuel Jackson. So what else you got shaking, Carl? Nothing. I live in Liberty City now. I'm clean, legit. Nah, you ain't never been clean, Carl. Well, what do we got here? This is a weapon, Officer Pulaski, that was used to gun down a police officer not ten minutes ago. Officer Pendleberry, a fine man, I might add. You work fast, nigga. You know I just got off the plane. Well, that's a good thing we found you and retrieved the murder weapon. That ain't my gun. Don't bullshit me, Carl. Yeah, don't bullshit him, Carl. What the fuck you want from me this time? When we want you, we'll find you. In the meantime, Try not to gun down any more officers of the law. <laughs> Y'all can't leave me here. This ball is country. I thought you said you was innocent, Carl. Shoot on bang. This is car 58. See you around like a donut, what? Carl. Officer <laughs> Pendlebury's down. We'll be right over here, Hernandez. Oh, shit. Here we go again. Worst place in the world. Rolling Heights, ball of country. And I ain't represented Grove Street in five years. But the ballers won't give a shit. Ah, shit. Here we go again. <laughs> Man, that was Samuel Jackson. I looked it up while the cutscene was playing. I thought it sounded an awful lot like him. Like, I'm uh, so sorry, let's just turn the radio, like, off, basically. I mean, we'll leave it on, because I don't want to literally have it off. But, um, and then I don't know... I don't know, like, what radio stations play reasonable stuff and what don't, so we're just going to leave it at that. That looks pretty good. We'll leave everything else alone. Use the left stick, press triangle. Man, it's been such a long time since I've even played a GTA game. 
So to pedal, hold down X. Okay. Isn't there a way to, like, pedal faster, though? I thought there was, like, a... Maybe that was a different game that I'm thinking of. But I could have swore there was a GTA-style game where you could, like, repeatedly hit the X button or something to paddle faster. But yeah, it might not have been this one. Or I could just be crazy. It might not have been anything. <laughs> uh, we're going so slow. No, there's got to be a way to go faster. Push up or down on the left analog stick to uh, to to change the way we sit on the bike. Holy crap. Come on, go. <laughs> oh, man. I forgot how slow this bike is. Okay, until we start going downhill, then we pick up some speed. Home. At least it was before I fucked everything up. No, you're right. Tap repeatedly. Is it tap repeatedly? Oh, yeah, it is. Okay, I just wasn't tapping it fast enough, I guess, or whatever. I thought it was tap repeatedly, but it didn't seem to be doing anything earlier. And then, yeah, of course, we can do wheelies and shit, too. You were doing dishes? Well, it's about time you got in chat, Mr. Noodle. Jeez. <laughs> I'm just picking on you, love. <laughs> Gets better the higher your stamina. Yeah, and that's one of the reasons why I really liked this GTA compared to the other ones. Was the fa fact that, like, the more fast food you ate, you could, like, gain weight or you could go to the gym and work out. And just, you know, the little things like that. I always thought that was really cool. And, but they got rid of it in the other GTA games. As, follow as far as I remember, none of the other GTA games do that sort of stuff besides San Andreas. I would love if uh, GTA 6, whenever that eventually comes out, you know, in 100 years or so, it'd be awesome if they did that sort of stuff there, added it into the game. Oh man, we're probably going to see that cutscene with the the order for the, the fast food drive through order. Some people, I know so many people that just have that like memorized, man. I'm pretty sure my brother's one of them. That can just rattle off the entire order by heart, like. They included some of that stuff in 5? I don't remember it, to be honest with you. I played a fair bit of 5, but it's also been, you know, years since I've played 5, so. <laughs> I don't remember it too, too well. Honestly, though, 5 was a ton of fun, man. Hey, hey, Big Smoke! It's me, Carl! Chill, chill! Oh, my dog! What's up? <laughs> hey, baby, you okay, man? Nah, man. It's my mom's, homie. Hey, I don't know why this had to happen, but I promise you, I'm gonna find out who killed your mom's. The streets is cold, dog. Like it says in the book, we are blessed and cursed. What fucking book? Same things make us laugh, make us cry. But right now, we got to take care of our business. <laughs> Go see your brother in the cemetery. Come on, let's bounce. CJ looks like he just wants to punch him in the face. Like, <laughs> he doesn't want to deal with none of this shit. Whatever the hell he's talking about. He ain't want none of that. No, 5, what I was saying, Five's actually a lot of fun. I really liked 5, and it's probably the farthest into any GTA game I actually yeah, got. Because cool. most of the time, I just devolve into screwing around, you know? Grabbing cool cars, doing jumps and shit, and blowing stuff up. Like, that's <laughs> that's what I usually end up doing in GTA games. I never get particularly far in the in the campaign, in the story. But I do, I, I want to rectify that. I want to fix it. I want to start trying to beat some of them, man. I miss you these five years, man. You're going to be real happy to see. Hey, what's up, y'all? Look who I found hanging around. Carl, hey, good to see you. I can't believe she gone, man. That's another funeral you ran away from, fool. Just like Brian's. Hey, she was my mama too. Not for the past five years she wasn't, nigga. <laughs> and where the fuck you think you going? What? Get out of my face. I'm going to see Caesar. The hell you are, girl. You ain't messing with them essays. You know we beat them. They ain't nothing but a Look, bunch I of low lives. Women. What the fuck are you? At least I got prints. Oh, and I guess that makes you an upstanding American. Carl, tell him. Carl, don't tell me shit, As long bitch. as he treat her right, disrespect you, and he did. How the hell you gonna say that? Like it's any business of yours. Fuck you, sweet. Oh, shit. Fucking asshole. <laughs> this shit's real fucked up. <laughs> uh, what you mean? 
What, apart from your mother being dead? Things are going real bad. Here, let me show you, running man. Tony's buried over there. Little devil over there. It, big devil over there. Man, it's just crazy. Everybody blasts on fools first, then ask questions second. Kind of a depressing way to start a game. Just, hey, guess what? Everybody you know and love from this town's dead. Besides your brother and sister. They're fine, for now. <laughs> like, holy shit, dude. Way to start out the game, you know? Ballers, drive by, incoming. Oh, <laughs> we gotta get back to the hood, man. It's Sorry. I Double shouldn't laugh. Down. It's just... <laughs> Uh, the beginning of the game just is ridiculous, man. Alright, let's go. So, to pedal the bike faster, repeatedly tap X. Oh, uh, yep, try, <laughs> try not to throw yourself out of the freaking car, though. This is what I was saying the other day whenever we were playing. Uh, you can do a bunny hop by holding down L1, then releasing it. The longer you hold, the higher you jump. Okay, cool. Uh, Need for Speed we were playing the other day, and I freaking rammed into something. And that's exactly what I was saying, is they need to add a mechanic where you just fly out of the front of the car like that, man. Whenever you wreck, because <laughs> that would be hilarious. Things has changed while here. Oh. Hey, watch your back right here, man. Guess we're going this way. I was going too fast. Crazy. Wasn't able to follow him because I was getting for. Oh shit! We are being shot at. Okay. A little, little bit off road. Nope. All right. So bad. It'd be nice if we had a gun or something to, you know, maybe shit, shoot on, back. On, Holy crap. Oh, you don't say, man. I just took, like, 20 bullets to the back. But, yeah. Now you realize that there's a freaking car on us. Hey, we can bunny hop higher? Hey, look at that. I'm just a lie. Oh, well, okay. You know what? I was gonna say I'm the liability here, but actually, I think you might be right, man. <laughs> Stay with... right. I'm trying! <laughs> oh god. Oh god. Sorry, sorry, sorry. Oh my lord. I'm gonna fail the first free commission in the game, man. I see it happening already. Can we like can we can we go backwards or something? Holy shit. What what is going on? Why can't I drive straight? Thank you. Okay. Look. Oh my lord! These cars everywhere. Don't y'all know to watch for bicyclists, okay? Get on the bike. Yeah, I'm, I'm trying. Stay with Ryder. I would love to stay with Ryder. I don't even know where he's at anymore. Where's our stamina bar? Don't we have, like, a stamina bar somewhere? Does it not show it to us? It might not show it to us. I don't remember. Holy crap. These are some tight alleyways. Alright. It's fine. It's fine. We're catching up. They waited for us a little bit. Um, are we going? Yep, we're going down here, I guess. <laughs> there we go. We caught up. See that? Oh, and we lost some fat. All that extra exercise, man, getting thrown off our bike repeatedly. It really helped out. <laughs> Losing some weight. We looking good. Why you bother coming back? I'm trying to, like, match this dude's speed, but I'm either going too fast or too slow. There's no in-between. That's one of the most annoying things in video games, by the way. Whenever, like, you're supposed to be following someone, but they are slower than your run speed and faster than your walk speed. Like, man! So when you leaving, Carl? I ain't sure. Thought I might stay. Things is fucked up. The last thing we need is your help. Ah, man, I won't let you down. I swear. Hey, we gonna call some hood rats and chill the hell out. You want some? I got a whole lot going on. I'm tired. I'll catch y'all later. Hey, yo, just drop in. We all hanging out. Gia, and get yourself some colors, fool. And a haircut. It's embarrassing to be seen with you. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> some of these models look a little, uh, a little ridiculous, man. I do want to try out, now I haven't seen very good things about them to be honest, but I do want to try out the new HD remasters that they've done of them. They look interesting to say the least, you know. A little bit of, uh, 
a little bit of polish, a couple updates or whatever, and I think it would actually be a pretty decent way to play the games. But sadly, they uh, weren't amazing on release, from what I've seen. I haven't personally played them, so, you know, it could be better than what I've been led to believe. But, I don't know, some of the, the rain textures and the, the, the water textures were, like, just all messed up. Some of the models just looked absolutely ridiculous. And honestly, like, this game doesn't look that bad, you know? Some of the models are a little bit jank, but... And obviously, it's a it's a lower resolution, but it doesn't look all that bad. You sent me a GTA TikTok the other day, Mr. Noodle? I probably didn't see it because I don't ever get on TikTok. But <laughs> if you, uh, whenever tonight or something like that, you'll have to actually show it to me, maybe. I guess we didn't really need to hop on our bike to go here, but whatever. Press L1 to answer your cell phone. We can do that. I never get on TikTok because I hate you. That doesn't make sense. Hey, what's up? Since you've been away, shit has changed around here. Grocery families ain't big no more. Seville Boulevard families and Temple Drive families are beefing and split with the Grove. Now we so busy, set tripping, ballers and virgos have taken over. So watch yourself out there. Yeah, I hear you. Thanks for the heads up. Don't mention it. Okay. We sprint by repeatedly hitting X? Or do we just have to run it? Or run it, hold it. So if we hold it, we run. Uh, we might go faster if we keep hitting it. I think we end up going a little bit faster if we keep hitting X. Seems like just kind of in general, that's what we want to do then. Whenever we're running around. I imagine it'll like burn fat, build our stamina faster or whatever. What you want? Seeing my homie. What's up with you? Yeah, homie. Yeah, yeah. It's good to see you back. No homie love? No huh? Oh, for sure, for sure, my nick. My bad. What's cracking with you? Hey, man, what you scrap for? Man, some piece of place keeps paying over our hit up, man. Shit is beautiful. Teach the owner a lesson. Fucking Grove Street. You damn? I'm always dead. Don't the cops already have you, like, pinned for murder you didn't do? Why are you just, like... <laughs> I don't know. Seems like a pretty poor choice. Show me how they drive on the East Coast, homie. Oh, you don't want to see how we drive on the East Coast. This is... <laughs> This is not what you want to see. I will end up killing us both, I promise you that. Press select button to change camera views. Push left and a log stick up or down to raise and lower the game camera. Okay. Okay. Yeah, but now I'm back, and I know what I've been missing. Don't expect me to kiss your ass a nut. You're still a buster to me. Yeah, okay. Thanks, homie. Yeah, don't mention it. Walk into the yellow marker to enter the barbershop? Okay. I mean, we kind of know how that works already. You did have us go inside the house not too long ago. You ain't got to tell us every little thing to do, game. We ain't that stupid. We're pretty close, but we're not that so stupid, you know? Son. Walk into the market to get a haircut. I honestly, I kind of like the hair we got. I'd be fine with just keeping what we have. Just clicking it once just lets us see it, right? Like we don't have to actually buy it. Can we, uh, oh man, I wish we could like rotate the camera around a little bit or something, but sure, screw it, whatever. We'll buy that one. Looks, looks good. <laughs> What else do we have? What's say what's the most expensive ones? Flat top, cornrow. What's uh what's the cornrows look like in this game? Does that change our facial hair too, or just yeah it does? Okay, so all shaved in the front, cornrows on top. I mean we don't have that much money, and I'm not gonna waste all my money on a haircut anyways. That dude's shoulder like disappeared. His arms look super long too from time to time. Flat top ain't too bad. But now we're just gonna we're just gonna keep we're just gonna keep the whatever it was called, the Caesar or something. Yeah, that that looks fine to me. Big smoke, he needs a cut. What is everybody's favorite GTA game, if you don't mind me asking? Shit. Like I mentioned earlier, I really like GTA San Andreas. This one. Man, you jacked up. And <laughs> Man, <what's this? laughs> does he always say that. I wonder if he says something different depending what. 
haircut we get. Shit. Looking too skinny, CJ. Go and get us something to eat. I'm gonna finish this. Then I'm gonna take care of business. Do not eat, you will lose weight and eventually energy. The red bar shows how much energy you have. You've never played so you don't you've never played any of them, Mr. Noodle, really? Eat too much and we get fat. Yep, yep. San Andreas is probably my favorite just because of the mechanics and whatnot of the game. Um but I did really, really enjoy GTA 5 from what I played. I just didn't care for the stupid online stuff at all. Like I, I couldn't care less about the online play for GTA 5. I've seen some like role play stuff for it, and that looks kind of fun. But the regular game, I just don't care. All you had to do was follow the train, CJ. <laughs> Man, I've never beaten any of them, though. Even this one. I've played so much GTA when I was younger, but it was always just screwing around, you know? It was never actually trying to beat the game. It was just you doing stupid shit. Uh, yeah, so what other meals do we have? We got the, the like, one slice there. It looks like a, a double deluxe. There we go, the big one. Come on, you got something bigger for me, right? A whole ass pizza, that's what we want. Oh, wait, does it go bigger? Ah, uh, no, we can, get, we can get a salad meal? You know, you know what? We're we're looking hungry, man. We're gonna get we're gonna get the whole meal, whole pizza, a fry, and a drink. Have a nice cheesy day. Have a nice cheesy day. Thanks, man. Let's try this tea. I made some tea right before the stream started. Haven't actually got the chance to try it yet. It's a uh, English breakfast move? blend. Ryder, not this again. It ain't me, fool. No one else is that small. I feel sorry for your dad. Not bad. Shit, you crazy. Hey, you thanks for the bits, Mr. Uh, Mr. Noodle. CJ, Buster, straight Buster. Oh, shit, run. Uh, <laughs> dude just pulled a shotgun on us. Holy shit. That answered my question from earlier, though. It is not uh, showing the emotes in chat for the for the cheer. Still. I don't know why it just doesn't. I, I got the bot working again at least, but some of the things just don't work. So you like it then? The tea? Yeah, no, it's a... Oh, man. See, I told you we're going to kill us both. Or I'm going to kill us both. You should not let me drive the car, man. <laughs> it's just a bad idea. Can we fit through here? No. No, we don't want to. We don't want to do that. <laughs> Look, it's fine. There ain't no cops around here, right? <laughs> um. Yeah, no, the tea, though. It's good. I like it. I don't know... If it really tastes all that much stronger than the other teas that I've been drinking, like the just regular Lipton or whatever. But the blend has a nice flavor to it. I think I would still use three tea bags instead of instead of two, though. You love this game? This is probably my favorite GTA game, man. I really like it a lot. Um, but it's been a long, long time since I've played any GTA game, including this one. The last one I played was 5, and I, I never got around to beating it. I, I feel like I got pretty far in it, but... Mission pass. Got a little bit of respect. Okay. You love this game, Avalon? Yeah. Is this, would you say, your favorite Grand Theft Auto game? For me, it's a toss-up between this one and 5, but... I lean a little bit more towards this one because of the whole stat system. I really like that. I told you that, bro. Your word don't mean shit around here. Come on, man. Give me a break. We gotta go hit up the hood. Hey, CJ, let them know you back San Andreas by far. Nice, nice. Is there anything specific about it that you really like? Like, just the setting or the story or... Is it like me, just the stat system, or? I prefer the the setting of this one to like GTA 4. GTA 5, I'm I, I like the way it's split between three different people. I think that's really interesting. You get like three completely different dynamics in the game and then uh it's just a, a decent way to keep the game interesting too like the story interesting always playing as a, a different character i just wish they wouldn't have pushed the online crap so hard but i guess i can't really blame them with as much money as the online play made them i mean 
I, I mean, I probably would have done the same thing if I was them, you know? Can you, can you get out of the way? <laughs> I'm trying not to run you over, people, but you're kind of right where I need to go. R1 to lock on, circle to spray. Okay. Keep circle press until the tag is completely sprayed over. You go get them, and I'll keep the engine running. Uh, we can, like, jump a fence, can't we? Yeah. Not that we really needed to there, but I need to remind myself how the hell to play the game, so. Two out of a hundred. Holy shit, okay. We got, a, we got one or two of these to find, then. <laughs> we don't have to find them all right now, of course, but yeah. The scale of the world, the freedom of everything, and the setting. Yeah, it really was just a really good game, and it's sad that it wasn't even a numbered game. And I feel like they didn't do this style of game again. Now, I haven't played very many of the side GTA games. Like, you know, all the Liberty City stories. And I, I know there were more of them. Wasn't there like a Chinatown one or something? I never played any of those ones. So I don't know if maybe they play a little bit more like this. But I don't think they do, right? Come on, that's cruising the ballers territory. That doesn't seem like the smartest thing to do. Chinatown Wars. Yeah, that was it. That was the other one. Uh, excuse me. Sorry. Didn't mean to hit you there, bud. Been driving. Five's probably your favorite now because of story. Yeah, I mean, five, like I said, the story and the dynamic of having three different characters that you swap between is really good. Like, whoever came up with that idea, genius, you know? But I, I really like the stat system and the setting from this one here. San Andreas beforehand did love 4, though, also. See, I never got that into 4. Like, I didn't hate on it or anything, but the, the driving mechanics just weren't that great. Like, it didn't feel good to drive around in 4. And uh, I never... The story never captured me before. Yeah. The story never captured me in 4, either. Find and spray over the tags. Okay. And that spray paint's got some reach on it, man. What does that even say? Grove Street for Life. Okay. That was... We had to know what it said. That was very important. <laughs> um, I don't think these guys will be too happy if we... If we start tagging over their tags right in front of them. <laughs> oh, man. <laughs> Press R1 to target enemies, then just... Spray them in the face. Okay. I mean, I guess that's... <laughs> what? <laughs> I mean, I guess that's one way to do it. I can't believe we got the cops on us, though, really. <clears throat> Go to the blip to find the next tag. Okay. These dudes were trying to kick our ass. All we did... Was spray him in the face a little bit, man. And, <laughs> and the cops are coming after us now, like... Uh, an upward purting triangular blip. Ah, oh, okay, I didn't realize we could jump fences that high, too. So it's been a long time since I've played. We have to go up on top of the building, don't we? Yeah, okay, that's pretty cool. That's pretty cool. I remember, like, San and Or not San Andreas. Grand Theft Auto 3 may be the one I technically played the most of. But I'm not sure. And that's just because I remember one of my friends had uh, GTA 3 whenever I was young. And I would go over to his house all the time. And we would, uh, that's what we would do. Me and, and a few other kids, we would just play GTA 3 constantly. That's where I was first introduced to the games, actually. Was at the, the friend's house. I'm glad this isn't uh, timed or anything. Because I'm just over here sipping on some tea. Chilling. <laughs> Uh, is there, like, a decent way to get down? Nope, just jump. Okay. <laughs> That'll work. Man, you drove the car all the way over here. Why didn't you just stay in the car? Is there a... Oh, okay, that looks to the left. That looks to the right. R1 is, like, a handbrake. I was wanting to see if there's a way to, like, center the camera. Doesn't look like it. I'm probably just missing it. 
I miss the way cars drove in these older GTA games, though. It felt really good. Like, it was arcadey. It wasn't realistic in any way, but that's fine. Like, I don't think GTA needs to be a super realistic series, you know? <laughs> Shame the remasters kind of suck. Yeah, I was talking about that earlier, man. Everything that I've read, I haven't tried them personally yet, but everything I've read about them says that they, they pretty much just suck. And I've watched a couple videos on them, some of the problems. Things like uh, that, that rain texture probably being the most famous example. Uh, but also, like, some of the water textures and, and things clipping. And I'm pretty sure that cop just freaking drove through something. Holy hell, man. In front of his car is all banged up and something exploded back there into a bunch of pieces. <laughs> I mean, we already know the crops are crooked in this town, so I guess that's not that big of a surprise. Yeah, it all comes back. How you doing on the Fetty? I'm kind of shocked, you know. Crash took all my paper, man. Left me with number small change. Hey, get yourself a beer or something. I'll catch up with you. Hey, 200 bucks and some respect? 200 bucks for some beer money? Like, that's kind of... <laughs> that's crazy, man. <laughs> I'd love if someone just randomly tossed me 200 bucks for beer money, you know? Don't waste your money. Even though they did technically fix all that, they still look terrible and they removed all the fun cheats. Ah, that's too bad. That's really too bad. The cheats were some of the best parts of these old games, man. Whenever I was younger and just screwing around all the time, at least. I wanted to answer your call. Yeah, we'll do that. Call is Officer Hernandez. Who? Officer Hernandez. I work with Tenpenny and Pulaski. Oh, the bitch. What the hell you want? Hey, show me some respect, boy. Go fuck yourself. You just they bitch. You watch your tone, boy. Now listen, I've got a message from Officer Tenpenny. Don't try and leave town. That would be a big mistake. You hear me? We're watching you. Whatever you say, bitch. <laughs> they get along great. That's that's nice, you know. They have a nice working relationship together. <laughs> but yeah, no, I remember uh one of my favorites was always the flying car cheat. I love just enabling that and then flying around doing stupid shit. And then of course like spawning in tanks and all that, you know? And guns. I used to have the gun ones memorized by heart. I definitely don't remember them anymore. I, I remember it was like a bunch of L1, R1, up, down, different stuff. But I, yeah, I used to have them all memorized. It was, uh, that's what I did when I was a kid. I didn't care about the story. I didn't care about trying to finish the game. I just wanted to drive around, steal cars, blow things up, and <laughs> cause havoc, you know? That's all I, that's all I wanted to do. Fly around, too? Oh, man. That is something I really like in the newer games, though. All the, uh... The jets and things that you can fly around. That's a lot of fun. Keep it real, man. Man, nobody give a shit about the hood. I do. All they do is sell yay and ruin the place. No crack ever made a gay type. I don't know, man. What's up, y'all? What's up, CJ? What's crack? Man, all they care about is smoking and money. You can't knock a homie's hustle, sweet. And Mark say soldiers. They idiots trying to be businessmen. Yeah, but they down with us, man. All they down with is money. CJ, go down there and show these fools you mean business. These chumps on the balls are sweating the homies. Go put pressure on. Let's do it. We've been putting time in the hood, but we got to get the homies back together. Like the old days. Mm -hmm. Yeah, yeah, you right. So you and Ryder go handle your business. Man, they're slang to their own mama. They don't care about nothing. You're naive, my friend. We got to keep our focus. We need some backup. You seen beat up? <sighs> nah. But him and the homeboy Bear, they good to have on our side. Oh. Big Bear? Yeah, them bass slang is gonna be sorry now. Another reason why I don't think it's really necessary to get the remasters, as long as you have an older console like this, is these games don't actually look all that bad, you know? They run well, they look fine. Like, yeah, sure, the, the newer games do look better, but, like, it's not bad. When on foot, press up to call Ryder back to your side if he gets too involved in a fight. Okay. Try to remember that. Probably forget it, but we'll try to remember that. <laughs> oh. Try not to wreck another car. Hey, slow down, fool. You don't even know which door it is. Whatever, man. This it? Yeah, this it right here. Open up! You sure you still live here? Fool, I told you this it. Open up! Who the fuck is it? CJ. 
fuck you want? Get the fuck out of here. Wait, hold up, man. What happened to for life, nigga? The only thing that matters is the hood, homie. But you'll never understand what getting this money is like. You know what, man? Get the fuck out of here for you be laying on your back. Big Bear, come check this fool. Hey, Bear? <laughs> Big Bear, that's you? Hey, you still from the hood, homie, nah, or what? the only thing Bear give a fuck about is smoking and keeping my house clean. Ain't that right, Big Bear? Hell yeah. Hell yeah what? Hell yeah, sir. Now go make that motherfucking <laughs> toilet spark. Oh, no, man. Oh, man. Bear, come on. Everyone likes to party sometimes, CJ. I'll see you around. Stay the fuck from around here. Punk. Hey, nigga, fuck you. That's actually kind of sad. <laughs> like, <laughs> fucked up. I see what you mean now, man. The crack can do that to Big Bear, turn him into a base slave. The average motherfucker ain't got a chance. Damn dope fiends and drug addicts everywhere in the city. Piss me off. Look like it's up to us then. Yep, that hits a little, little hard. Uh, <laughs> all right. Get in the car, man. Let's go. I ain't got time to wait for you. I mean, we do. We got all the time in the world, but <laughs> don't mean I'm gonna leave your ass anyways. So we're just gonna find some random person. Don't even matter who, huh? Just, uh, yep, we see some people over there. I guess, all right. I guess this is what we're gonna do. And we're just gonna use spray paint to do it, because... <laughs> <laughs> I, can't, <laughs> I can't believe we just spray painted that man to death, dude. Man, like, you know, yeah. or not to death, I guess. Just knocked him out. You're a baller, OG from Idlewood. <laughs> I know his place. It's just across the tracks there. Let's check it out. Hey, ain't that front yard turf? Man, are you a buster? Nah, I'm down, homie. Hey. Oh, there's a bat? Yes, sir. Thank you. And how do we switch weapons? Is it right? Left, down, select. Nope, selects camera. I don't remember how to change. There it is. L2, R2. Okay. And I mean, I guess we could have hopped back in the car, but screw it. We'll just run over. It's not that far. While targeting an opponent, press triangle for a special attack and square to block. Okay. We'll, uh, we'll definitely remember that. <laughs> no way will we forget that in like two minutes. Man, you can smell a crack den a mile away. Yeah, let's shoot through and introduce ourselves. <laughs> I love that's just the actual name of the place, just crack den. Good afternoon, ball of dope pushers. Grove Street OGs come to do damage. Fuck them Grove Street fools. Grove Street going down. <laughs> I'm sorry. Just <laughs> the way the, the game looks and the scenarios that they get into is just kind of ridiculous, honestly. But again, I mean, that's kind of what makes GTA good, man, in my opinion, you know? It's just being stupid and ridiculous. I'm trying to... I'm trying to block, but I can't block. <laughs> I'm gonna die. This <laughs> GG here, man. <laughs> Mission failed. Oh my lord. I was hitting X or X. I was hitting square. Right? It was triangle for special, circle to attack, square for, for block. And I'm stupid. I ain't that stupid. If your health reaches zero, you pass on, you'll be treated at the local medical center. But we lose our weapons and uh, some money, right? Can eat food, use health pickups, or you can protect yourself by wearing body armor. Okay, okay. For your discharge, hospital staff will confiscate your weapons and bill you for the health care you received. Yeah, that's what I thought. That's what I thought. So do we get to keep our bat at least, or do they take everything? They take everything, okay. <laughs> well. <laughs> what the hell, man? People need to chill. Coming out of the hospital, almost got hit by a damn police car, like... Run around all over the place. Got us gaining some muscle. Very nice. So we need to, uh, we need to get a car. Can you, uh, can you stop for a second? Thank you. Hey, I just need to borrow this real quick, if you don't mind, man. Once he has dragged out a driver or passenger, move the left analog stick or press circle. Okay. 
so how do we continue that mission we were already started on? Do we just go back to the house? And do it from there? The the green marker? Oh. Sorry, I wasn't paying much attention. My bad, man. Look, I was looking at the map. Or no, that's a house we can buy, isn't it? Yeah. Yeah, I know. Okay, so how do we open up the map? Ooh, a cinematic camera. Very fancy. Not using that. <laughs> map. Okay. And do we have a GPS feature or like a, a mark where to go feature? I don't remember. Target. There we go. That'll work. That'll do. Uh, that might be a little too far. There we I like that one. Not too close, not too far away. Goldilocks zone. Perfect. Just running into light poles and shit while the cops are just kind of staring at us. They don't care. It's fine. Oh, sorry, man. Look, I ain't, I ain't from around here. I don't know how to drive too well. <laughs> and as we keep taking damage, it's just getting worse and worse. It's harder to control. Everything's fine. Yep. Oh, okay. Perfect. And we'll just, uh, oh, nope. Not, just, uh, Pull in the, the it's right here. I can't see where I'm going. <laughs> oh, Lord. You know what? Maybe at this point, we should just get out of the car. I think that's a pretty decent idea there. Yeah. <laughs> oh, man. Oh, it's a garage. The garage door is trying to open for us because probably because the car is back behind it. Yeah, it's fine. I don't want to keep that car anyways. <laughs> I don't think that car is worth uh, keeping around too long. I'm sure we'll find something much, much nicer here soon. Hey, you gotta keep it real. All right. At least they have a uh, cut scheme, hey, cut scene skip feature in this game, man. I hate that in old games all the time, whenever you uh, die or something like that, and you gotta play through all of the cutscenes again. Is there... Subtitles. Uh, probably not. Gallery display, maybe? Yeah, subtitles. There we go. Definitely want that on. Map and blips? Map and blips is fine. We'll just leave, we'll leave everything else alone. Gotta get some subtitles on. I like reading subtitles, man. I'm a little bit weird. Plus, Mr. Noodle's like deaf, so... If she ever actually watches it, it'd be nice if she could read and see what's going on. I guess it also helps, you know, whenever I'm talking over the shit all the time that <laughs> I try not to do that too often, to be honest. But sometimes, sometimes you just, you just, uh, got something you got to say. Let's just cruise through the hood and find us somebody selling. Maybe not die this time when we're doing it. Actually, I guess we did this part just fine, didn't we? Man, you ain't even got a car. You're just walking around. I gotta say my car's whack. How considerate of me? I know. Aren't I the best? Y'all are in the way. <laughs> My buddy can't get in the car here. I need y'all to move a little bit, please. I love how whenever people are getting in the car, since they're stuck in the animation, you can just drive, and they uh, just get dragged along with it perfectly. Hey, check it out. Somebody's selling one of the homies. Well, we ain't got no spray paint this time, so uh, I guess we're just going to have to do this the, the old-fashioned way, man. <laughs> Just, just fists. Ah, oh, he ain't even got a chance. He ain't even touch us, man. Pulled out that baseball bat and then just got his ass beat. Hey, grab hold of that bat over there. Uh, this ain't our car. My bad, man. <laughs> I thought that was my car. I'm, I'm sorry. I promise, I really didn't mean to rob you. Yeah, let's shoot through and introduce ourselves. I mean, it is part of the game, though, you know. It's literally called Grand Theft Auto. So you got to commit some Grand Theft every now and then. Good afternoon, ball of dope pushers. Grove Street OG. Yeah, we don't need to watch that again. Uh, I don't know if I'm going to ninja anybody. I'm not... I'm not uh, that good of a fighter, I promise you, but 
I can I can maybe uh I can maybe knock him down a little bit. Are you gonna do anything or are you just gonna you just gonna walk around a little bit there, buddy old pal? Get out the way! I wouldn't be hitting you with a bat if you weren't staying in front of me. Is there anything we can like steal? Got like some cash laying around, maybe maybe some guns or something. No, nothing. That's a uh, excellent looking dresser there. <laughs> For as detailed as the city is and everything like that, they really kind of phoned home this, these couple of rooms here, didn't they? <laughs> like, this room's literally just empty. There's nothing in it. And I don't think I saw a bathroom. They have a, did they have a toilet anywhere? Where the hell they, uh, they going number two at? Man, I don't know. Yeah, no, they ain't. They just got a, a bedroom, a kitchen, and then some random ass empty room. That's it. They probably did it so there wasn't a long loading screen between the two different sections, to be honest with you. Just this quick little thing. I imagine that's why it's uh, not particularly detailed, but it still just feels weird. I mean, what do you expect? You went into their house and just beat the hell out of them with a baseball bat. Do you think they weren't going to get mad? Later, homie. Hey, some more respect. No money for that, man? You gave me some money for laying down some, uh, some graffiti, but... I go up in someone's house and beat the hell out of them with a baseball bat, and you can't even give me some money for that? I don't remember just the random, I'm guessing it's meant to be like drive-bys or something, but just the, the random shots you hear in the distance all the time. I don't remember that from what I played before. All right, we're going we're gonna to drop a quick save and take just a one to two minute break so I can stretch my legs a little bit, maybe uh, refill my drink, and also run a quick ad so we can get rid of the pesky pre-roll ads. And uh, Twitch is going to make me run one sooner anyways, so... We'll be back in like two minutes, guys. I I honestly don't know. All right, more dudes are spawning in. We'll just uh, we'll just stay back here. We'll just stay back here. Let y'all uh, let y'all congregate over there. Maybe we can get a, a hit in every now and then, you know, just a, a little bit. I don't know when this game was put out exactly, but I feel like there were definitely games with more solid shooting mechanics out way before this game you know <laughs> like i mean goldeneye 007 was far from perfect if you go back and play it now but even it i uh i, I feel had a little bit more solid to shooting mechanics oh, i see we also got another weapon here at some point i don't even remember picking this thing up but all right does it have like a, a limited range or something oh, okay dude spawning in dude spawning in everywhere holy crap well, I think we just got a game over. <laughs> We're at zero, and we died. So does that mean GG? I think that means GG. Yep, that's a GG. <laughs> All right. So it's going well. It's going well. Also, it looks like it may be... I'm going to switch my personal view here to out of OBS. I want to make sure that it's not looking darker than it's supposed to. I, my setup hasn't really changed other than the fact that I'm using a different cable, but I did upgrade my RetroTinks firmware, and I'm pretty sure I have the settings mostly set the same as how I had them before, but because of the problems we had with uh, darkness and levels before, I just want to make sure this is how the game is supposed to look with it being somewhat dark. We'll play, uh, we'll, we'll get to a point where we're like a, a safe here or whatever and then i'll switch the view back over to my uh obs view here and then compare the two but now granted it's on two different monitors but from what i can right. see so far though it looks feeling like all stretched out and loose let's uh let's get back into it man Just had to take a real quick break there oh you know, I remember growing up, I could just sit in one spot for like 12 hours straight playing video games, but now just sitting in one spot's hard, you know? That's <laughs> how you know you're getting old, when sitting is hard. <laughs> 
Oh, this is the drive-through scene. Yeah. Respect has to be earned, sweet, just like money. So what you saying? You don't respect me? What I'm saying is, speak up, nigga. I'm hungry. Oh, man. <laughs> hey, man cannot on? live on bread alone. I know. I tried that shit. Carl, you look a little thin, man. You got to be hungry, man. Yeah, man, I what you eat. fools trying to eat? That's what wrong. about some tacos? Tacos? Again? Hell no. Nah. Chicken, man. No discussion. Man, I don't want no chicken. Big smoke in his order. Yeah, it's so iconic. I know so many people that have it just completely memorized. My brother being one of them. <laughs> I don't know how the hell he memorized it, but he can just rattle off the entire order like it's nothing. What was that? Some information? I ain't that worried about it then. We'll ignore that. I thought maybe it was a gun or something. Same here, really? <laughs> yeah, I never got that good, man. Of course, I didn't usually play through the, the beginning of the game, you know? I played through the beginning of the game like once or twice, and the rest of the time I was just playing on a whatever save file I had. But then you see like in memes and shit all the time, though, so that's probably honestly how my brother memorized it. He definitely played the hell out of this game, but memes and videos and shit like that. Because them are all over the place with this order. Hey, I'll take a number nine, fat boy. Give me a number nine, just like his. Uh, let me get a number six with extra dip. I'll have two number nines, a number nine large, <laughs> a number six with extra dip, a number seven, two number 45s, one You've completed this game like ten times, no shit. Just like beginning to end play through it? That's insane, man. And here I am, I've never complete one <laughs> GTA game. That's insane, Avalon. <laughs> I do want to play through them. I don't know if I want to play through one and two, but like three and up at least. I want to I wanna beat one of these days. Now I'm getting hungry. <laughs> Can never get through more than about half a stream without getting hungry, man. This game was huge for me, I can tell. <laughs> I mean, you play through it ten times. It's not exactly a short ge game either. I mean, I'm sure you can make it through pretty quick. Playing it as much as you have, but... But, uh... It's what, like a 30, 30 hour game or something like that? play through it 10 times that's that's a lot <laughs> can, can somebody shoot maybe can, he's right in front of us man shoot i can't shoot at this point though right yeah no no i mean okay if i got beside him i probably could but i don't have a gun so you know uh i was trying not to hit that cop i'm pretty sure that was a cop on a bike uh, maybe, maybe get away from the car that looks like it's gonna explode. Yep. Ah, <laughs> uh, no. Ah! <laughs> Stay out the car! I'm sorry, I just ran over you like twice. There's no way you ain't dead. No. Hold on, we'll go back to Sweet's house, but real quick. I gotta, I gotta pick up these guns though, man. Gotta get weapons somehow. Alright, we'll get out of here. I hear I hear some some ambulances and shit in the distance. We ain't want to deal with none of that. Get the hell out of here. <laughs> yeah, man, those baller fools won't try that again. So let's get back to the grove. Right, we, got, we only got like 30 shots, so we don't got a whole lot of shots, but at least we got a gun now. I love big smoke. <laughs> the whole time, just ah oh, man, I spilled my drink. <laughs> Talking about his food. <laughs> While the rest of the car just murdered two dudes. Like, holy shit. Big Smoke is, uh... That's mood right there, man. Big Smoke's big mood. That's one up for the grow. Say what, Smoke? All you managed to do was eat my damn food up. Yeah, it was getting cold. 
Y'all coming in for a beer? Nah, baby. I need to get back to the crib. CJ, give me a ride. All right, Smoke, let's go. See y'all later. Wait, does Smoke not live here with the rest of us? Like in this little... What do you call these? Call it a sack? No, not call it a sack. Whatever these uh little dead end things are here. Man, if you can eat your food while everybody else is losing theirs and blaming you, you straight home. What? Nothing. This dude makes no damn sense. I mean it's a nice place and all, but the grove is in my heart, baby. It's where my dogs is at. Okay, homie. Oh, look at that. Thanks, Got a fancy house I over here. Miss having you around, baby. You Got a whole porch and everything. Sweet thought like that. He don't mean to CJ. He's still real tore up about your mom's, man. Here, get your stuff a little smoky smoke on smoke and relax. <laughs> a little smoky smoke on smoke. There we go. That's what we need. Give me a little bit of money, man. Uh, it said something about respect up there, but I completely missed what it said. Alright, so that's a tattoo place. We need to go to the tattoo place right now. Let's bring up the map again, though. Is there any other, like, missions-type stuff we can do right now, or is it just the one set? So... Legend. So that's sweet. That's tattoo. So it looks like it's only sweet right now. It's the only only missions we got. That's fine. We can drive back on over to home. Luckily, we already got a marker to send us on over that way. I'm tempted. <laughs> I was just thinking, man, I should go get some food in the game because I'm getting hungry IRL. Like, <laughs> I have no idea what the hell I'm going to eat tonight, though. They were talking about tacos. Now I'm wanting tacos. But I ain't got nothing to make tacos. Maybe I'll, uh, I don't even know, some chicken nuggets. That's probably <laughs> something easy. That's probably what I'm going to end up eating if we're being honest here. Look at that big ass cell phone. If you don't respect your body, ain't nobody going to respect you. You're too skinny, CJ. You need to pack on some muscle. If I want a nagging, I'll buy a clockwork wife. Just looking out for you, homie. It's all show and respect, you know. Yeah, I guess. There's a gym I go to a couple blocks out from the Grove. Go check it out and get yourself a gangster physique. I'll scope it up. Oh, I didn't mean to skip the the call there. I was just trying to get in the car. If you want to increase your stamina or muscle, or if you want to learn new moves, check out the gyms around San Andreas. Go to the dumbbell icon displayed on the radar and check out the gym. We'll probably actually do that a little bit. I remember liking the the gym. I mean, the, the mini game that you play in there or whatever. It's just, what, basically hit X a bunch of times or something like that? I don't really remember all that well, but I don't think it's anything complicated, but getting extra stamina and strength can be really helpful, actually. You can run around longer and faster. You can uh, ride the bike faster for longer. I not, I don't really remember, but I'm assuming that having the extra strength also helps. Strength and muscle would also help with melee weapons. Okay, dumbbell icon. Maybe we haven't actually unlocked one or found one yet. I would have thought that with them just telling us about it that it would have popped one onto the map somewhere. I may just be missing it, though. That's all right. We'll come back to it then. Whenever we see one, we'll go and do it, but we're not going to worry about it that much. Not worth it. Turn our ass back around, I guess. I'm glad the car repairs itself a little bit after uh, all these different missions. Either that or we just accidentally stole another car. At some point, that's a possibility. I mean, there does look like there's two of the same exact car, so... I don't know. <laughs> Maybe there's some sort of weird wormhole shit going on here or something. It's just off Grove Street? Man, I must have completely missed it on the map. We'll do it after this mission, then we'll probably stop in there. And lift a little bit of weights. Give me 15, motherfucker. I'll write it down in a second. I ain't gonna pencil with you, fast sucker. Let me play first. Hey, right, what's up? What's up, man? Right. Who winning? Who you think, huh? Me. That does it. That's game Nolan and boy, motherfuckers. So, uh, what kind of guns we working with now? One times came through, raid the spot. We ain't got shit now. Well, what you gonna do if the ballers roll through? Throw shoes at him? Say, what happened to Emmett? <laughs> Emmett? <laughs> shit, 
Gangs these days got Max, AKs, and all kind of stuff. Emmett, on the other hand, ain't got shit. Well, until we get that plug, we gotta deal with a cat that always been there for us. Emmett, Seville Boulevard families. We ain't too close these days, but nonetheless, I'll take you to see him. Get ourselves strapped up. Come on, man. Nigga, shake him up again. I mean, I already got one gun. I don't know if it's any good, but at least we're not completely uh, unarmed here. Little SMG and a baseball bat, that's all you need, right? I wish it'd be nice if them people didn't just like walk literally right in front of your car all the time. Bad blood leads to bad blood. If you read the book, that's the way of the world, baby. Yeah, but you know you gotta keep it real. I admire you, Carl. You're a leader, a visionary. Remember me <laughs> when you get to the top. Man, Smoke, I think you're just smoking a little too much. <laughs> exactly. You're full of shit, Smoke. Calm down, man. Uh, can we fit? We got it. Look at that professional driver right there, man. <laughs> Them need for speed skills are coming in handy right about now. Oh my god. <laughs> what you kids want? Hey, hey, Pop. Hey, what's happening? Aren't you Beverly Johnson's boy? That's right. Brent, say, ain't you dead? No, nah, Emmett. The other one, Carl. I'm sorry about Beverly. That's why we're here, sir. We want to get the people who did it. Well, you come to the right place. Try anything you like, boy. Man, look at this old shit. I mean, old shit's better than nothing, right? Like... <laughs> Press R1 to target and L1 to open fire. Okay. And we can freely aim. Can we uh invert the controls or is they already... Are they already inverted? Shit, I'm the best they ever was. I mean, I don't know about that, but you're something, Big Smoke. Yeah, that's real Grove Street style now. While locked on, you can cycle through targets using L2, R2. Oh, that's actually pretty helpful to know. <laughs> That'd be a lot easier probably than letting go of the lock on and locking back on over and over again. I knew I was the chosen one. Oh, man. Check out Special Agent Big Smoke. You can increase your accuracy by crouching. Press L3 to crouch. Okay. Oh, you're making me so proud. And it is already inverted, actually. That's perfect. That's how I like to play. I can't play with regular controls, like up being up, down being down. It screws me up so bad, man. I've been that way forever. I don't know how people do it. Of course, these days, I'm no good with a controller in general. I'm too used to playing on PC. <laughs> like trying to aim with a controller is hell. Baby, ice cold. But remember something. Real strength come from within, my brother. Listen to the boy. Yeah, I guess liberty didn't soften you none, huh? Hey, look, let's split. Hey, I see you round, Emmett. I'm a hundred percent behind you, boys. Did but we even pay him or anything, or did we just steal the guns from under him? Like... Emmett is a place for guns. I've always got high quality merchandise. And I've been proudly serving the community for over 30 years. <laughs> Crazy old fool. Hey, <laughs> yeah, I kind of expected that. I always got to drive. Ah, oh, I didn't mean to skip it. Oh, well. You can visit Emmett at any time to get a gun. Okay, good to know. What's going on, man? Shit seems pretty fucked up. People have to open their eyes and their hearts, CJ. What are you talking about? I'm talking about the choices all men face, brother. Sometimes they seem real, but other times there's no choice at all. At least you still talking shit. You ain't changed a bit. Who me? No, never. Excuse me, you wanna you wanna get out the way? What you putting your hands up for? Just move. Ah, whatever. Goodbye. <laughs> I gave her a chance. I st sat there for like Thanks, CJ. twenty seconds. That's more than enough time. She could have got out of the way. It's on her, not me. Speak. I thought 
thought you was representing. What? Correct me if I'm wrong, but I thought you was rolling with Grove Street again. Already told you I am. Well, I ain't seen you in your colors yet. You gotta fly the flag, man. Ain't nobody gonna respect you if you ain't representing your hood. All right, man. My bad. I just ain't got around to it yet. There's a beacon around the corner from the gym and Gatton. Go get yourself some green. Oh, God. Thought we were gonna get hit. Go over to Binko and get yourself some colors. Okay. Steal this car over here. Station wagon. That looks like uh, something CJ would drive around right there, right? He's a family man. I mean, the whole reason he came back to town here is because uh, his family was in trouble, you know? <clears throat> and nothing says family man like a nice uh, station wagon. Just needs some wood paneling on the side, really. Oh, and there's the gym, too. I wonder why it's not coming up on the map. It looks like we can't go in right now, either. Probably because we're in the middle of the mission or whatever. But at least now we know vaguely where it's at. Binko Clothes Shop. Ain't no place to get clothes like Binko's. <laughs> I, this, I, don't, I just don't understand the name at all. Binko. What kind of name is that for clothes? Walking to the market to try on some new threads, okay. Change your name's over there, sir. Thanks. Never would have found it without you, lady. The bright glowing red circle on the ground wasn't good enough. Use the left analog stick to select area. We want just torso, yep. And I guess green, because if we don't wear green, we're gonna <laughs> have some people not too happy with us. A hoodie in this weather seems like maybe a bit much, but uh was there was there anything other than that? Green? We got black, green, white, LS, sharp green shirt. Maybe just a green shirt then. That sounds pretty good. There we go. Wait, that was 40. How much was the hoodie? I wasn't paying enough attention. I feel like the hoodie might have been ch cheaper than the short shirt was. Holy shit, I can't. I think one of the era shirts are green too. Too late now. <laughs> Dog tags, African pendants. We only got 550 bucks. We probably shouldn't waste money on <laughs> on dog tags and shit. But I don't know. I kind of like it though. Ten bucks? Yeah, fuck it. We'll buy it. I don't know if I like the way she said that. Alright, we're out of here. That's all we need. We got the green. We got we got a chain on. It's not much of one, but you know. We got we gotta we gotta look fresh, man. Alright, so that's the mission done. So now oh, I see the dumbbell. That doesn't look like a dumbbell to me. <laughs> On the minimap there, that does not look like a dumbbell at all. But at least now I know what the hell I'm looking for. Let's hop into here real quick. Work out. Dirty up our fresh new threads. Like, go in here and start sweating in them. Hopefully we got a washing machine in our uh, home somewhere there. Our house somewhere. Yo, you want to learn some new moves? Uh, sure, why not? Get yourself some muscles first. Okay. Don't make me mad. Oh, okay, okay, okay. I couldn't remember how we how we did it. I guess we should probably start lower, right? Let's do 100. 100 might still be a lot. Sit around and remember how I do it. To lift the weight, alternate between X and O. All right. So wait, is there any? You're well toned. Keep this up, and your attacks will inflict more damage. So it does do that. I thought it might. Okay, let's uh, let's rack that up. What happens if we select like a shit ton of weight? I'm assuming it just gets harder to do. But is it at any point is it impossible with our current our current muscle toneness, muscle massness? Uh, CJ, that's not how you use a a, a bench, man. Look, you got it. <laughs> Holy shit, CJ, get on the get on the bench. 
Okay. Uh, it seems like it won't let us do that. Maybe we'll switch to something else then. Yes, at some point it does become just impossible, or yes, it's just harder. <laughs> I guess we'll find out. 100 pounds here. Holy crap. Yep. There we go. It's definitely harder. <laughs> Holy shit. Okay. Yep, that might have been too much. Too much weight and you can't do it. <laughs> I mean, it seems like it's technically possible. We got one, but, oh, man, but it is not easy. <laughs> he's going to he's gonna hurt himself, man. I'm surprised he hasn't already blown out <laughs> something. Oh, Lord, okay. Ah, oh, two. There we go. You just got to, you got to get really fast and consistent. Come on, come on. Just get to the next level. Three. We got this. You using two hands, four. This is giving me a workout in real life over here. There we go, slowly building it up, just don't screw it up. Oh, okay. Deep breaths, deep breaths. Just keep going, nice and consistent. Keep hitting it, keep hitting it, don't let it fall. Don't let it fall. Oh no, come on, come on. Oh my lord, we were so close. Gotta like sit the controller down over here. Oh, man. This is... There we go. Five. Come on, just level up. Level up. Oh. <laughs> this is legit, like, where I got my arm. Or my, yeah, my arm. My forearm here. How many do we have to do to level up? Will it tell us again if we level up, or does it only tell us the one time? I'm going for 10. I'm going to try to get 10. Come on, I can take it. But my arms like in real life my arms like tired here. <laughs> it will tell you. It will tell you. Okay. Well, I don't think I can go any further than 10 to be honest with you because it's wearing me out IRL. Holy shit, we might not get past 7. But only completed reps count? Yeah. I kind of figured that much. Oh, man. Gotta, gotta shake out my hand a little bit here. Get a little bit of bud flow going back in it. Ah, oh, come on. It gets so close. It goes down so fast. Yeah, okay. It's definitely not worth it. I'm done. <laughs> my arm's like actually wore it out. Holy crap. Okay. Will it, will it let us go back to the bench now? It will. We'll do, uh, I don't know. 100 was a little bit too easy, I think. We'll try 160. We'll try that out. Hopefully that one's not too bad. Yeah, there we go. Okay. 160 is easy. We could have done a fair bit more than that, I feel like. I imagine the, oh, there we go. We already got the, we already got the upgrade. So we were so close. If we had made it to 10, we probably would have got it. But oh well. I imagine the heavier the weights you uh, use, the less reps you have to get to get to the next level, but the harder it is to do. Uh, I don't know. Let's start with level four. X rapidly to begin to pedal. Okay. Change the level. Five. Six. There we go. Oh, seven might be, seven might be a bit much for us. Come on, eight. Nope, seven, six. Holy crap, man. This man can pedal. All right, that's good enough. <laughs> it's not like we're fat anyways. We don't really need to worry about that. I don't think we can do anything with the bags. Can we run? We can. We'll, uh, we'll try level four. So it's the same as the other one, right? Press... Change the level, press left or right. Okay, we can do that. Maybe, if we'll get on the treadmill. If your power bar empties, you will fall off the treadmill. That's good to, that's good to remember. Okay, okay, yeah. So this is basically the same as the, the bike. Just if we, uh, if we fall too far, then we, <laughs> we also fall off on this one. 
I kind of want to fall off just to see what happens. Yeah, let's do it. <laughs> okay. <laughs> I was uh, I was wondering if it would be anything like a little more silly than that, but yeah. Man, you're an embarrassment. Get yourself some muscles. What do you mean? I thought we did. Okay, I guess we got to get buff. Two forty. Question mark. <laughs> That might have been a bad idea. We'll see. Oh, no. Okay, we got 240. 240 ain't nothing. We can do that. Oh, man. I feel like we could have gone up higher even, to be honest with you. Oh, okay. Well, we hit our limit. Is that true across all of the equipment? I can't remember, man. It's been so freaking long. So we can't do that anymore. But can we do the dumbbells? Nope. Okay. That's fine. We'll come back tomorrow. I gotta get buffed so we can learn some new new moves, man. Some new ways to, to kick ass. <laughs> or maybe just not get our ass kicked as much. That'd be nice, too. Uh, excuse me. I'm trying to get through. Thank you. Appreciate it if you knock it in the way. So now we got... Two different places we can go. We can go do for big smoke and then is the regular S, is that just smoke or what is his name? My memory's terrible. It'll tell us on the map, right? Legend Sweet. That's it. Big smoke and sweet. So we can go to either one. We'll go to uh we'll go to sweet, I think. Just keep up keep up with them ones. The yeah, Avalon says sweet, yep. I think we're on a, a bit of a delay. BS is Big Smoke. I remember that one, but I am just terrible with names, though. I always have been. Can we jump over this? Uh, kind of. <laughs> Not particularly well, but technically. And then we can flip our car onto the highway. Yep. Driving skill. <laughs> That's a bit of an ironic time for our driving skill to go up, man. Right as we were flipping our car there. <laughs> and it just blew up. Yep. Some good driving skills right there, man. Oh, two of them blew up? I'm guessing somebody must have hit our car after we flipped it. <laughs> or there was one just like uh, sitting by it when ours blew up and that did enough damage to catch theirs on fire and blow it up. Oops. I could drive as well as CJ, man. I'm telling you. <laughs> yeah. Hey, homie, what's up? Hey, what you saying about me, fool? Up, man? I'm saying that. Hey, thanks for the five bits, Mr. Noodle. Idiot, fool. I appreciate you a lot, love. Cars and, shit. and for some reason now, you back. All it is is CJ dry here, CJ dry there. Bullshit. Man, why don't you just take it easy? No disrespect, man. Hey, you're number one again? Look at that. Thanks, man. No, Congrats, no, no. love. I'm happy for you. you such a good gummin, homie. You gotta ride shotgun. Show CJ what's cracking. Let's just hope nobody else comes along and uh, <laughs> outbids your bits now. I think it does reset like weekly or monthly or something like that, so. That probably helped too. Drive our homies into Bala territory. Do us a little drive by, huh? You know something, matter of fact, you are chauffeur for this little gig. Come on. G, thanks, G. Just don't drive like no fool. I'm pretty sure that's all I can do is drive like a fool. Oh, that's a dead end. That's not where we wanted to go. See what I mean? I'm already getting lost. Is this really the person you want you uh, driving you around while you're doing illegal activities like drive bys? You really want somebody that ain't even know where the hell he's going driving you? I'm just saying I don't think it's the best idea, man. Uh, okay, where's the off ramp at? Oh, that's a light pole and the medium. That's fine. Look, we can drive right over it. The car's got a little dent or two, but if you uh, if you squint a little bit, look at it from far away, you can't even tell. Oh lord, that's. Is this like 244p graphics or something? Uh, probably 480p. That's what the PlayStation 2 does. Generally speaking, I mean, it could have been lower. But considering that I'm doing the PS2 gauntlet, I'm, you know, <laughs> playing games on the PS2. Ball is turf. You dogs ready? Yeah, for sure. I'm ready. Carl, just concentrate on the driving and we'll take care of the shooting. Listen to the man, fool, and try not to park us up a tree or something. 
I can't promise you anything there, bud. I'm pretty good at getting us up into trees. <laughs> also, welcome back, Kane. Nice to see you, man. But yeah, I'm not actually sure. I know you were uh, just joking around, but I'm not 100% sure what the PS2 ran this game at. I'm assuming to four, or I'm sorry, 480p, but hey, thank you for the 300 bits, Kane. Appreciate that, man. And uh, <laughs> congrats on being the new bit leader. I'm sure Mr. Noodle will be happy to see that. <laughs> I'm not sitting, I'm driving around, man. What are you talking about? Hunt down some more, okay, where are they at? Oh wait, I guess we could have probably just drove around in, like around and around the block then, instead of just going back and forth across one. Uh, don't hit the taxi cab. What's the reverse button? Square. And now it's raining. See, if we were playing the remaster, we wouldn't be able to see anything right now because the freaking, <laughs> the freaking rain is terrible in those. Holy shit! How many drive-bys we gotta do in one day? I feel like we've already done enough, man. Uh, don't stop. Hopefully the car health isn't our car health. I think it might be actually. <laughs> now that I'm looking at it a little bit more closely. I think the car health indicator, I was thinking that was for the enemies. But I think that might actually be for us. Which is uh, definitely not good because uh, we're about to die. Also the frame rate is uh, struggling just a little bit here. Not nearly as bad as Killzone, though, man. I don't know if anybody's ever played Killzone on the PS2, but it is rough as hell. Yep, nope, we're dead. Yep, nope. Uh, <laughs> your homies didn't make it. Yeah, I see that. Uh, <laughs> good thing they can just uh, respawn, right? Look, we'll uh, we'll take this car here. This car looks nice. We'll get in. We'll get in this one. Maybe this one here will have a little bit more health than. Uh... <laughs> Man, you can't just shoot somebody for stealing your car. Chill. Look, I'll bring it back. I definitely won't bring it back. Oh God. Yeah, I'm pretty sure that I picked the wrong person to to drive them around. Not that I'm any better with a gun than I am at driving, though. Either way, I think we were pretty screwed. Really, they should just not include me in this at all. Okay, hi there, sir. I'm trying to get through here. If you don't mind just getting the hell out of my way, that'd be nice. Sorry, I'm sure you were a nice lady. I didn't mean to, like, murder you. Oh, God. Don't look at chat. Looking over at chat is a good way to run into a light pole. And just <laughs> ran the hell out of someone. The internet says 720 by 480, that's pitiful. Yeah, I mean, that's what pretty much every PS2 game ran at, though, was 480. 480i. There were games that ran at 480p, but those were more rare. Wasn't until the PS3 that, and Xbox 360, of course, the higher resolutions became more common. There are a handful of games on the uh, PlayStation 2 and original Xbox that could run in HD resolutions, like 1080i, but it's a... Uh, Fairly rare, from what I know. I don't believe there were more than a handful of them that did. I mean, you gotta remember, too, that the PS2 is, what, 20, 20 years old, give or, give or take? A couple years? Like... And honestly, in my opinion, it doesn't look all that bad. But I also play a lot of retro games, so, you know. If you play a lot of uh, modern titles and not a lot of retro, then I guess it probably would look pretty bad. <laughs> and obviously, I mean, you take this game and compare it to something like GTA V, then yeah, I mean, it's not going to hold a, a candle to it. But compared to other retro games, eh, it doesn't look all that bad, man. Maybe we shouldn't destroy the car before we get into 
the actual mission part here. Well, San Andreas was released in 2004. Yeah, so I mean, this one game was released almost 20 years ago. 18 or whatever. Just concentrate on the driving and we'll take care of the shooting. Listen to the man, fool, and try not to park us up a tree or something. Yeah, if the car stops, we dead me. Press L2 or R2. See, the problem is, guys. Oh, not trying to hit yet. I'm trying to get turned around. The problem is, y'all just aren't killing these dudes fast enough. I can keep the car moving. Do I gotta? Do I gotta drive fast? Is that what you want? That didn't seem to help at all. <laughs> and hitting other people definitely isn't helping anything either. I know we're sitting because I'm trying to get turned around. Look, I told you you done messed up having me drive. Oh lord, I hope we don't have to do more than a couple groups of these people, because otherwise we are, we are screwed. <laughs> Move it, CJ. What is you doing? CJ. I'm trying to turn around. Look, if y'all have a problem with my driving, one on one, y'all take over for me, okay? You can do the driving here. Man, what is your I don't remember asking for this responsibility. Oh, get out of the way! There you go. Come on. Come on. Shoot back. Don't just sit in the car. Oh, y'all too busy eating or something. There we go. How many's left? Looks like two. Hopefully those are the last two guys. <laughs> Pretty sure we're screwed if it's not. What are they doing? Are they running from us? I'm kind of surprised to be honest. Or is this a whole nother group? Oh, no, okay, they did. They were actually running. What do you mean, find us some more? No, no more, man. I'm calling it here. That's it. We're done. We don't want to be fighting nobody else. Wait, where are they at? Are they underneath? Oh, they're, like, down in the, down in the park there. Okay. Oh, God. Keep control. We got this. We just ride around in circles on the, the the sidewalk here. Oh, no. Oh, we'll have to try to remember that. I'm not going to remember it, but the badge there. For if we ever get into a bit of a police chase. Oh, yeah, you messed up getting right in front of the car like that. Can we, like, handbrake it? Uh, a little bit. We can get a little bit of a drift going. Ah, uh, don't hit the tree. Come on, just get him. What are y'all doing? Finally done driving well until you start heading home. So you're done dashing for the night is what you're saying, man? Hope you had a pretty decent day out there. Oh, he's like hiding behind the freaking... Oh. <laughs> uh, oh, we got... Okay. So there we go. Perfect timing. Look at that. We got some cops on us. We can just run over here a little bit. Uh, try not to hit anything too bad, because the car is getting close to blowing up. <laughs> and then go to the spray can that is blinking on the radar. We got it. It made you stop, or you'd still be dashing? Oh, is it like, uh, like they have a mandatory stop time? Like, can you only dash so long in a day? Or is it just because all the businesses are done dashing for the day? Or, or why'd it make you stop, I guess, is what I don't understand. As somebody that's never dashed a day in their life, you know, I don't... <laughs> I don't 100% understand how it works, other than you download an app, orders come in, you pick up those orders, and then you get paid. That's pretty much all I know about it. The business part? Oh, okay, okay. So all of the local restaurants or whatever are done fulfilling orders, basically. I got you. I knew that was a thing. Because I know, like, uh, my brother dashed for a little bit. And he told me about that. Like, uh, like 10 o'clock our time or something like that. One level has been suspended. If you commit a crime while the stars are flashing, your full wanted level will be reinstated. Got it. You're allowed to dash for, like, 20 hours straight. They don't care as long as you don't have an accident. Okay. I'm kind of surprised, to be honest. Because the whole, uh... 
what are they called? Like truck drivers have limits on how long they can drive in a day, right? But I guess that only applies to truck drivers, not other driving professionals. <laughs> You would think, though, like, I mean, I know, I understand, like, a car is a hell of a lot smaller than a than a semi truck is, but you would think driving's kind of driving, right? If the laws applied to to truck drivers because they don't want them overworked, exhausted, and having accidents, you would think they would apply the same kind of laws to delivery drivers of any sort, or like mail drivers and all that all that BS. Cars don't weigh 40 tons. Truckers can only drive 11 hours in a 14-hour span. I didn't know exactly what the rules were, but I did know that there were rules on how long they could drive in a day or, I guess, in a 14-hour span. And yeah, yeah, cars don't weigh 40 tons, which I understand. But still, like, you can do a lot of damage getting into an accident with a car the same as a truck. It's just easier to, to <laughs> cause some major damage in a big truck. So watch yourself for now on CJ. Yeah, yeah, for sure. You know that. I'll see y'all later. Here, take this. Go get yourself some beers. Oh, the 20-hour part is only because of businesses, too. See, that I didn't realize. Didn't know that at all. Okay, so now we got another set of missions open. We can do Sweet, Big Smoke, and what does the R stand for? We got the map. Rider. So we can do Rider, Big Smoke, and... Sweet. Let's do uh we haven't done any big smoke missions. You know what actually we haven't done in quite a while though? We haven't saved and taken our break. So we're going to do that just so I can stand up, stretch out a little bit, get rid of the pre-roll ads and stop Twitch from forcing an ad break on us while we're in the middle of gameplay. So we're going to save real quick, just take like a 2 minute break and then we'll be back with some more Grand Theft Auto San Andreas. Maybe a little bit dark may have to uh change it out of right now i have it on full mode i might have to put it on the limited mode which i think is actually now that i think about it while my monitor itself looks great in full mode i think obs did have problems with it now that i now that i remember so yeah let's uh let's just do it now let's just do it now we'll just pull up the menu if i could hit the right button and then HDMI, we want color space limited. I think even though it looks a little washed out now in my monitor. Yeah, I, yeah, that looks much closer to how it looked a moment ago as far as OBS goes. So this is how we want it. Perfect. Glad we got that sorted quickly and it didn't uh, not like 10 videos deep or something like that. We could definitely use a health pop-up. Is there a chance of any of these boxes dropping health? Or is that just not a thing that's going to happen? Looks like that's not a thing that's going to happen. Which is too bad because we definitely need some health. Also, am I, am I blind? Am I missing something? There's nobody here, right? Oh, wait. Is it behind the boxes, maybe? Oh, come on. Can we, can we get up here, please? Nope, nothing there. Did, did the game glitch? Basically, you can start at I feel like the game 5 glitched. and go until 2 <laughs> if you go to the right areas around here. That's oh, insane. Dude, yeah, no, it definitely did. There was I don't think you should. <laughs> bomb, For your own personal health. On. like the thing on the I don't think that's the best there, idea there, Nate. But area, so. uh, I guess if you're ever in a tough spot. I feel like we might have had that conversation <laughs> before. Like if you're ever in a tough there. spot, it's nice you have the option <laughs> to do that. Right but for here, personal health you. reasons, I don't think you necessarily should plus. go for that many hours in one go, you know? <laughs> it seems like seems a little excessive. That's uh that's what, 20, 20, 21 hours? Like you haven't, but it's possible. That's a good thing. You probably shouldn't. <laughs> that's uh a man needs some sleep, man. I forget the exact numbers on it, but they've done studies and so much sleep deprivation is the equivalent to just being drunk as far as like driving and whatnot goes reaction time and all that it's like it's probably for the best if you uh <laughs> make sure you get some decent sleep before you start going crazy you know usually don't go past 12 16 would be your personal max and that seems pretty reasonable i mean 12 even is a fair bit but again i understand people get into rough spots sometimes lord knows i've been there and could use some extra money 
I've considered door dashing for that very reason too, just to get some like extra money, not doing it as a full time thing, but yeah. Also, why are we just like running where we're going? Is there, we need a car. Can a car spawn in for us maybe? Eh, uh, stop. Thank you. Ooh, you, you look, uh, yeah, whatever. Yeah, oh, well, I mean, you didn't have to punch him, man. You could have just taken him out of the car. Holy shit. That was a little much, but <laughs> I guess it is what it is, man. Hi, Mr. Cop, sir. Uh, we definitely didn't just steal this car. Can we... Yeah, we can go through here. Big Smoke's actually right on the other side, isn't it? I can't believe, like, at one time I had this entire map basically memorized from playing it so much. Nowadays, I'm just completely lost, man. It's been so long. There was a time where all, like, GTA 3, uh, San Andreas, and Vice City, I could basically drive around them entire cities without a map or anything like that. That's on catching up. If things are good, you would literally just go till you hit 100, 150, which can happen in like four hours on a lucky day. That's awesome, man. Yeah, that's uh, my brother did it full time for a little while, and he told me like the money wasn't bad. It wasn't the best money he's ever made, but it was far from the worst money he's ever made. A lot better than doing like, uh, what's it called? And, uh, minimum wage jobs like when he was working at taco bell or something like that you know you were the same way in saints row games can that's the only gta like game i've ever beat and only saints row 2 i haven't beaten the other ones but i really like saints row 2 as well and i want to play some of the other ones man can we not get over the media in there it's annoying anyways uh because they they get a little bit ridiculous but honestly i'm into it like going to hell and gaining superpowers and all that bs like <laughs> It just sounds like a fun time to me, man. Plus, I think these games are at the best when they don't take themselves too seriously. Saints Row 2 was the hardest one. See, I wouldn't know because that's the only one I've beaten. <laughs> but yeah, it took quite a while, but I did beat it. And I definitely didn't do all of like, the, the extra stuff. You know, I, I didn't 100% complete it or anything like that. But yeah, I beat it probably like, man, it must have been eight years ago or something like that. So I remember I was still living in this shitty little apartment. It was, uh... I was playing it on PC. Played a shit ton of it. Saints Row 2 was the best, in your opinion? I need to play the other ones at some point. I watched, uh... I don't remember who exactly, but I watched somebody on YouTube play a fair bit of... Was it Saints Row 4 or 5? The last one. The one that just became ultra ridiculous with the superpowers hey, and all that BS. What's happening with you, Jeffrey? Hey, man. It's OG Loke, homie. OG Loke. Ah, uh, ah, uh, my bad. How was it, though, homie? Man, what you think? How was it? Hey, chill out, dude. So what you want to do now? Man, I got to kill some Chola motherfucker. He was dissing me, man. Hey, Jeffrey. I thought you was going to, uh... College. <laughs> <laughs> College seemed to go well for this guy, yeah. Little ridiculous. Like it don't happen often often. You've gotten real lucky and could have took five days off before because you made just under your weekly set in two days. That's incredible, man. What's your plan? Okay. Yeah, I'm sorry, officer. I didn't mean to hit you. But now we got to do this whole thing where I run away from you, and you try to chase me down. Uh, well, you had to do some extra stuff because you couldn't... Yeah, no, no, no. I mean, I just didn't do, like, all the extra stuff that you could do. I did the minimum to get through the game. Maybe not the literal minimum, but I don't remember, to be honest. It's possible I did do the literal minimum, because it's been, it's been a long time. Also, that car just, like, hit us into somebody walking along the street. It may have been a police officer. Uh, is this the paint and spray? Yep. Oh, wait. We don't need it. We already lost our star. We're good. Yeah, I don't remember very many specifics about Saints Row 2, to be honest with you. I just remember that I played it, I beat it, and I enjoyed it. And, obviously, as a GTA-like game. <laughs> Where are we going, exactly? 
I guess we need to go to the other side. Cross this bridge right up here. Has anybody... I'm sure everybody else has done it. It can't just be me. But ever played GTA trying to follow, like, all the traffic laws and everything? Like, driving around trying to stay in your lane, following the red lights, doing all that good stuff? I've done it. Just for just for shits and giggles. Obviously, that that's not the way to play the game. It would take so long to get anywhere and do anything. It'd be ridiculous, but... Sometimes you gotta switch it up a little bit, you know? You can't do the same thing all the time, just blowing shit up. Tried it, that lasted all of 20 minutes? Yeah, that sounds about right. <laughs> Nate, you too? You too? Yep, yep. Hey, I'll stick with Jeff... I mean, Lope. Okay, cool. I'll see you guys back on set. I mean, after, you know, running around and just blowing shit up a, a million times, sometimes you just gotta do something a little bit different. Be a nice law-abiding citizen, you know? Get out of my face. Man, what you yelling at me for? <laughs> I'm over here trying to help you out. Freddy, I'll come for you, you motherfucker! Hey, Lo, hold up! Jeffrey, you got the wrong idea, man. That was just a prison scene. I, I got plenty of muchachas on the outside. I don't need your scrawny ass. Oh, no. <laughs> I don't know what he talking about. Hey, yo, give me back my rhymes, you thief. I'm gangsta. You dropped the soap, sugar. I'm oh, no. <laughs> hey, hey, motherfuckers making a run for it. <laughs> hey, yo, so, uh... <laughs> Luke may have been someone's prison bitch. That's all I'm saying. Catch and kill Freddy. Okay. Oh, sorry about that, Kane. Yeah, we don't we don't do links. If you tell us what it is, I mean we can uh, look it up, or maybe myself or one of the mods can can post it for you. But yeah, obviously the uh, links can pose a bit of a problem, so I have that turned off. You typed five minutes in me to type. Oh, okay, okay probably just put like a, an extra dot in there somewhere on accident or something like that then and it thought it was a link the bot can be a little bit dumb sometimes <laughs> okay yep man i we need to get our driving skill up oh wait he just turned around Lo, shoot the man all right now i can't be too mad at him i don't know if i'd be able to shoot the man either with someone driving like this oh my lord we need to get our driving skill up a little bit. Both in real life and in the game. <laughs> Look, I don't need you talking shit, okay? We already having enough trouble here. Okay. I like the blur effect whenever you start going fast, we're gonna die. Holy shit, how are we still on the bike? Can we shoot too? We can, can't we? Maybe not. I thought we could shoot somehow. I'm sure there's some way to do it, but I don't remember how. Okay. Catch me if you can. Don't. What are you? What are you doing? This dude's actually crazy. Just leave him be. I don't think it's worth it, man. We are gonna die. I. <laughs> Oh god. <laughs> oh no. <laughs> oh, we are so bad. Or I'm so bad, I guess. Can't really blame the dude on the back of the bike here, Mr. Mr. Loke, if you will. Freddy, where you at, man? How the hell can I hear you? I don't even know where you're at, man. You must be hollering loud. Are you back in here somewhere? No. What the hell? Oh, there he is. Well, that worked out. I feel like we could have killed him by now if we were the ones shooting. I don't know. Okay, well. <laughs> how, how are we alive? This ain't right. Oh, no, he went down there? Okay. Look. This is embarrassing, to say the least. Where the hell did he go now? Oh, I see him. I see him. He's all the way up there. You know Thanks for waiting for me, man. I appreciate that. Would have been real bad if you wouldn't have waited. Okay, we just lost control of the bike a little bit. 
fishtailing. Oh my lord. How are you swerving around these things, man? Ain't nobody driving that good. The AI can't find the bike. <laughs> I'm surprised it didn't fail us already, to be honest with you. With this many times we've fallen off the bike and he's gotten away from us, like... I would have failed us if I was the game. How is he still alive? For real, though. I think Loke's just the worst shot in the world. I'm not even positive if we've hit him yet. Oh, there we go. There we go. Okay, look, he ain't even on the bike. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> Get off the bike. Get off the bike. I'm gonna die if I stay on this bike. How do we shoot? I forget how to shoot. Oh no, this is bad. <laughs> I don't remember how to lock on. Oh my god. All of that just to die because I can't remember how to freaking lock on. <laughs> oh, I'm so mad right now. Oh. <laughs> and that means we lose all of our shit too. See, this is why you need cheat codes, man. You just cheat in all the weapons. Alright, so we gotta we gotta stop by Emmett's place real quick, I guess. Are you a cop? Yeah, I think you're a cop. Who's shooting and why? Oh, okay, well. Look, dude, can you not see these dudes shooting at me right now? Why are you not doing anything about it? Guarantee if I would have shot at them, they would have been all over me, but... Oh. Man, we're gonna die as soon as we come out of the freaking hospital. Look, give me your bike. Alright, you know what? Screw it. We're just going over the edge. <laughs> we almost died straight out of the hospital. <laughs> Ridiculous. All right, let's pull up the map here. Where's uh, where's our man? What's his name? Emmett. I think his name's Emmett. Where the hell is he at? He's got the gun symbol. That makes sense. We got we got to get ourselves a new weapon here, man. Turn on the target. Can a can a car spawn in? Maybe. Should probably grab some food too. In the game, so we can get a little bit of health back. I'm sure there's a health pack around here somewhere, but I don't know where the hell it's at. this uh oh we don't have any spray paint anyways i was gonna say we could tag that real quick but not without spray paint we can't hey there we go i'll take your bike get on the bike don't just steal it for like smack someone off of it and then just stand around what the hell all right i see some pizza let's get some pizza that's what we like to eat around here mr noodle i'm surprised she hasn't popped in chat just at the mention of pizza man never met someone that likes pizza as much as she does. I'm fairly certain I could order pizza seven nights a week and she would be completely down for it. Alright, come on, pizza stack. Load up. Oh, oh. Hmm, there she is. There she is. <laughs> I was just saying that I'm surprised I haven't uh, seen you in chat. We're over here talking about pizza. I haven't seen you in a while. You would be, yep. <laughs> Caught it. Enjoy your meal, sir. Uh, Enjoy, one more? Sir. Okay, there we go. That should be good. Not full health, but it's close enough to full health. That make us fatter? Maybe a little bit, but not a whole lot. Pizza's good. I mean, I agree. Pizza is good. But seven nights a week? That's a little bit much, though. Can't eat that much pizza. Alright, I'm not gonna make y'all watch me do that same mission again. We're gonna <laughs> we're gonna go to one of the other ones, maybe. Oh, that's right, we still gotta go and get a gun though. Cause I don't know what these missions will be having us doing, but I feel like having a gun would probably be in our best interest. Okay. How did we fall off the bike like that? That didn't make no sense. Uh dude, you're the one that hit me. You can never have enough pizza. I'm pretty sure you can. I mean, I've eaten a lot of pizza in my life, and after like one box goes down, it starts to it starts to get pretty close to having too much. Oh, so he said, yeah, <laughs> yeah, right after you uh you were talking about getting number one spot again, love. Kane came in and uh <laughs> and uh, took your top spot there. Sorry about that. <laughs> I'm kind of surprised she didn't notice, to be honest. Maybe she's just ignoring it. 
pretending it doesn't uh, doesn't exist. She's still number one. Sorry, I'd always make sure she knows she's number one in my heart at least. <laughs> <laughs> there it is. There's the face. It's all right, love. You'll get it back. If not, uh, if not this week or whatever, you'll get it back. Uh, whenever it resets again, I'm sure. <laughs> Let's try Ryder out. We haven't done anything for him. Oh, only between 12 and 8. Okay. That's fine. We can go to bed. We'll go to bed and come back. You'll always be number one. Always number one in my heart. That's right. Don't you forget it, love. <laughs> can we just go to bed or do we have to save to progress time? Oh, that's our wardrobe. I didn't mean to load into that. We're not over here changing our clothes or anything. What is so that's to actually change our clothes. Yeah, we don't want to do that. We just want to go back out. Here's our room. We got ah, oh, there we go. We got some spray paint in here. I didn't know that. Press L1 to pick up this weapon. Oh, that's just the camera. I ain't, I ain't worried about that. So you can take pictures and and then look at them in the save menu, right? Or not the save menu in the options screen. Gallery. Yeah. Take a photo with the camera. Press circle, or you can take the photo by pressing L1, and it will be added to your gallery. Yeah. So. We're not worried about that. I guess we'll save real quick. Maybe just entering your house and leaving would be enough to progress time, but I, I'm not sure. But I know saving does, so we'll try that out. 9.31. Are we... That's not late enough, huh? They said between 12 and 20. So I guess that's a decent way to test this, though. We'll load back into the house and then load back out and see if time progresses any farther. Nope. Okay. Well, that's fine. What does, uh, what's Sweet got for us? Maybe Sweet's got something we can do for him then. We can come back and try Ryder later. Sweet's girl. Fuck they had. Damn. Fuck it. Okay. <laughs> that's a that's an interesting way to start a mission, man. Just go into his house and just nobody's home. Hey, cry no time to chit chat. Been seeing a Seville family deer work out on the street and the boys don't like it. I'm pinned down in Seville hood and we need a ride out of here. Pronto. Oh, for sure, man. Hang in there. Drive by Emmett to get heated. Wait, do we do we drive by to get, like, more guns? Or are we just keeping the ones we got? Wait, weren't they green shirts? The dude that he was just shooting at? I thought we were supposed to be friends with the green shirts. Also, why don't we have any car out here? That would be... <laughs> that'd be super helpful, honestly. Uh... Just wait... Oh man, okay, I was hoping maybe the car spawned in behind us or something. Yeah, I see. Sweet's taking some damage. There we go. Thank you for stopping. I'm not sure if a drop top's really what we want right now with, uh... With everything that's going down, but... <laughs> we gotta get over there fast, man. He's losing health. The Sweet ain't looking too good. Uh, okay. I like the, the skill system, the stat system in this game. Like, the fact that even your driving skill and whatnot gets better. Driving, bicycling, running, like, everything. Seville Boulevard family has sweet surroundings. Girls flat. Take those Seville boys out. Oh, we got a... Ooh, okay. We might need a little more ammo than what we got. Also, we need to figure out how to shoot the gun. Uh... Okay, so that's, that's aiming. There we go. Okay, so it's R1. R1 is what we wanted. Also, crouch. Crouch behind the car, please. Please don't blow up, car. Oh, man, we're wasted. Holy crap. Okay. <laughs> so, so we figured something out here. We can't, <laughs> we can't shoot. That's all it is. Anytime that, there, that there's guns involved and bullets flying, we're just meant, not meant to be there. Maybe We probably should have just tried to hit them with the car, honestly, is what we should have done. That probably would have been smarter. I don't want the taxi. Why? 
are there always members of the other gang outside of the hospital trying to kill us? Like, like is that their their area just right outside the freaking hospital or something? I I don't want the the minivan. I think I'll pass on that one. We'll take we'll take this one. Technically, groceries divided into grocery families. Temple Drive and Seville Boulevard, and are all at war with each other. I mean, <laughs> that just seems like bad business, man. If you can't even stick together, how do you expect to? Uh, how do you expect to accomplish much of anything? I don't remember from my time playing Grand Theft Auto V a few years ago. Can you still collect? Houses like buy houses and shit in the new ones or did they get rid of that too? I feel like they got rid of that too, didn't they? I remember doing that a lot especially in Vice City Buying up all the houses and whatnot. I don't remember doing it as much in San Andreas But it's probably because I was too busy driving around getting buff at the gym and then fattening myself up with shit tons of pizza <laughs> Go get another gun. A little bit of ammo maybe would be nice too, but I don't think we've unlocked proper gun stores yet, so. You can buy businesses. But not houses, right? Just businesses? And the newer ones? And are you talking about four or five, or is that both? Like I said, I really don't remember, man. My memory is poor. Yeah, just grind up against that wall a little bit. That was that was good. Good job. I don't know if 16 shots is going to be enough to take these dudes out. I guess, like I said, uh, we can probably just ram the car into them. That should work. <laughs> take out a few of them that way and then use the gun to take out the couple that are remaining. Okay, that curb is a hell of a lot bigger than I expected it to be. The whole car went in the air on that one. Uh, where are we going? We're not going to Big Smoke. We're going to Ryder. If it's available, but by the time we get there, it shouldn't be. Five and yeah, all have already or got upgraded through story. Uh, okay, okay. So I want to play through them all. This is definitely going on the list of games that I would like to complete on stream eventually. Uh, I don't know when exactly... We'll start playing this one. That will be decided, I guess, after we finish playing up Ratchet and Clank. However long that game ends up taking. But after that, we do need to pick a game to complete on stream. This one's a bit long, which... I mean, kind of sucks just because, you know, we just finished up a 30-hour game. But I'm not totally against it either. If this is what people want to see. I don't remember what other games I have on the complete list after we finish up here. Hopefully we can actually not die on this mission. But <laughs> after we finish up here, I'll take a quick look at the list and give everybody a uh, a preview of the different games that I would like to complete on stream here at some point as part of the PS2 collection. Alright, so the other card disappeared, but at least we have this card now, so... Excited for Rift Apart. Rift Apart. Oh my lord, I can't talk. Words, man. Excited for Rift Apart. Surprised you didn't do a playthrough already. Man, trust me, I <laughs> I thought about it. I've been occupying my time with Final Fantasy games. Otherwise, I probably would have broke down and just did it off stream already. But yeah, no, I, I've really been wanting to play it, though. And I'm excited that uh, we finally finished up Lord of the Rings The Third Age so that we can now. I mean, it's a relatively short game, though, if I remember correctly. From what I've read, I think it's only, like, uh, for main story, like, 8 to 12 hours or something like that. So it shouldn't take too, too long to complete it. Which, honestly, like I said, is kind of nice after, after playing such a long game. Get out of there! Run away! <laughs> I was hoping the explosion would maybe take one or two of them out, but I guess we can't get that lucky. There we go. That worked. Oh, there's one up top there. Holy crap. Okay, go away. Go away. Go away. <laughs> oh, man. Sweet's going to die, though. <laughs> we, need, we can't just run away. We're going to die. 
There's no way, man. We're so screwed. Hold on, get in the car. Maybe, uh, maybe we'll be lucky. And we won't get hit. Where are they at? Where are they at? I mean, we ran over him. Why isn't he dead? We ran over him twice. How are you not dead? Just die. <laughs> Thank you. Where's the other one at? Oh, crap. Get out of the car. Get out of the car and run. Try not to get shot. Oh, I'm so mad. Okay. <laughs> I give up. I give up with it, man. We're going to try... Uh, we'll try the rider one if we get there on time. But... Otherwise, yeah, we're just... <laughs> but we'll definitely be coming to back to this game sooner or later. Oh, that... Okay, well... I'm kind of glad we glitched on top of that taxi, because otherwise we would be halfway dead again already. Which isn't how I want to start getting directly out of the hospital. What the hell? Did that police officer just freaking <laughs> break something again? Police officers are worse drivers than I am, man. And trust me, that's saying something. Because I am not a good driver, as should be obvious by the fact that I just rammed into that dude. Alright. Oh, that was a nice car. We should have grabbed that one. Alright, we're going to go back to Emmett's one more time. And then hopefully make it back to Riders before 20. I mean, I don't know what he has us doing. We might not even need the gun, but... The last thing I want is to go there and need it. Uh, what's the best way to get over there, I guess? Just keep driving this general direction. No, it's screw. We're just going to stop at Riders before we even get a gun. It'll be fine. I'm sure he won't have us doing anything too dangerous. Home and... Okay, well... <laughs> that worked out well. I'm sure he won't have us doing anything too dangerous. Instantly go into home invasion mode. Awesome. That's uh, that's the mission we wanted. What the hell? Damn. What, you doing? Digging graves? what are you doing? Damn, where the fuck I put it, man? Put what, nigga? Man, the fucking water. I need the a little something before I go deal with things. What things, fool? My homie LB, he told me about this army motherfucker who got all the guns we need. Not that old school Emmy bullshit neither. I'm dead. Water? That's wrong. Jill, you always down, homie. Apart from when you ain't around here. Nigga, fuck you. I'm not gonna pretend to know slang too well, but what the hell is water? Nah, like... I'm cool on that. Where we going? This tilt overlooking East Beach. Better yet, we better wait until it's dark. I still don't know what the hell he was looking for. Over here asking about water, like... I don't know what that means. I'm sorry. What is... We got like an armored van or something that we're going to be rolling up in on? Park the truck near the house and get the guns before daylight. Okay. It is something made of H2O. Oh, damn, man. Sounds like some, uh... Relax, man. We ain't some high-quality shit right there. It's a really messed up drug. Okay. You can't stop me. Who can't? Whatever. So, daylight. We got... I'm guessing that's seven minutes of daylight left? Or seven minutes until daylight ends? Might be seven minutes until daylight ends. It'd be kind of dumb if we, uh, started this mission right before daybreak when we wanted to do it at dark. Plus, yeah, no, okay. If we look at the time, it's 2243, so definitely... Definitely seven minutes until daylight ends. Also, this car cannot go uphill for shit. <laughs> um, how do we get over there? I guess maybe go down here water is the street name for a cigarette or marijuana joint dipped in liquid pcp okay 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 see i knew i know what pcp is and i knew people did stuff like that but i had never heard it called water before 
honestly, I don't think I had ever heard it be given a name before. So. And why the hell would he want to smoke that, of all things, before going on a mission like this? Like, <laughs> you want to be hallucinating while you're out here trying to rob some dude? Storm the place. Hold up. Let's creep in, grab the guns, and bounce out. Gee, gee, I got it ninja style. Right. Come out, you old bastard. Shut up. <laughs> you can't stop me, you buster car. Okay, fool, in you go. I'll keep watch. I'm pretty sure Ryder's just trying to die. Like, <laughs> I think he's got a death wish over here. Just <laughs> hollering out this dude's house, who apparently has got a shit ton of guns. Like, must remain silent at all times. Wearing the ski mask, gently push the left on analog stick to sneak. Okay. Make too much noise, you will wake the inhabitants of the house. I mean, this dude looks pretty old. We might be able to just take him in a fight. Um, okay, so we need to find a crate. We need to steal at least three crates of guns. We can do that, I think. Oh, and then we gotta take them out of here. Okay. I'm assuming they're not all gonna be as easy as this one, but... Has to step up his game and get a Jeffrey, then? Isn't that that thing from the movie? Uh... Oh, shit, what movie was that? Keep it coming, CJ. I feel like... Was it Day Pineapple Express or something like that? I don't remember. I can't remember what movie it was, but I feel like it was from a movie. Also, what is on this dude's ceiling? Uh, okay. Sorry, I guess we can't open the doors. I just realized who we got five minutes left. So that is five minutes until daylight comes back. Like, <laughs> I feel like maybe we should have uh, not waited until quite so late at night to get into this. But just so you know, the cat is hunting and you don't appreciate it. Well, <laughs> let the cat have its fun. What's the other one doing? Just being lazy, I'm assuming. We have one cat that loves to run around and play and hunt and shit. And then we have the other one that just wants to lay all day and do nothing. Although I was surprised to see that he did actually move a little bit earlier. <laughs> Not a whole lot, but he's, he swatted around a toy like three times. Get him to the Greek. Ah, okay. Yeah, see, I never would have remembered that. I'm fairly certain I've seen the movie. The name doesn't sound familiar, to be honest, but... I mean, uh, the Jeffrey thing did, so. She's really interested in the Ottoman. Well, hopefully there's not, like, a, an actual mouse that's snuck in or something. I mean, it is getting cold outside, man. The mice might be wanting a, a nice warm house to chill in, you know? <laughs> You're very slowly taking things off. Why, are you scared that there is a mouse hiding on the Ottoman somewhere or, or in the Ottoman? We've had, we've lived in the house where we're living at now for what, six, seven years or something like that. And we've had one mouse the entire time we've been here. And uh, I think it kind of traumatized Mr. Noodle a little bit. <laughs> Amazing movie, said Nate. Said, I'm sure I've seen it at some point, but. Housebreaker, homie. <laughs> Furry walls, you just have to. Yeah, they were in like some sort of club or something, weren't they? Whenever that happened. Pretty sure there is. Oh, wait, like for real? You think there is? Well, we have those two other mouse traps, so we'll have to uh, we'll have to set them. Are you almost done? Yeah, I'm almost done. Let me finish up this mission, love, and we'll wrap things up. Uh, try not to wreck the truck, though. Maybe. Mice are friends. I mean, I don't hate mice or anything, but I don't want them in my house either. One day you gonna wish you hadn't pissed me off. Did I hear something? Sound like the Buster complaining again. Some, <laughs> and some good friends here. There's a pack of Oreos that has a hole in it. Yep. Okay. Then it's uh, we definitely got a mouse over there. Then love, <laughs> like, all right, we'll set some traps. Mites are awesome. You used to have pet mice. They're so cute as babies after they get their fur. And I mean, yeah, if I had them in a cage or something like that, that'd be one thing, but I don't want them running around getting into my Oreos.
Oh, Mr. Noodle, it's gonna be okay. You can perform burglaries at night when not on a mission. So this was the uh, the precursor to the robbing banks thing <laughs> in GTA 5. Robbing people's house at night. You need to get in this type of van to start the burglary. Okay. Load up the truck and then take it back to the lockup. Ugly as can be before the fur. I've never actually had a mouse as a pet, so I wouldn't know. Your cat likes to bring them to you like a toy so you can almost throw it. Yeah, that's why she got so traumatized because we, one of our cats plays fetch with uh, little mice toys. So <laughs> it took one to her and she thought it was a, uh, a toy and almost picked it up and threw it. But all right, guys, I guess that's going to have to be. Yeah, we actually passed a mission, but I guess that's going to have to be it for the night. It was just about time for us to finish up anyways. And it seems like uh, Mr. Noodles needs some help downstairs. So that's going to be all I have time for tonight. Like I said, I will throw this on the list of games that I want to complete. And we will definitely be coming back to it sooner or later. Just not sure when exactly. But uh, before we go, thank you so much, everybody, for joining me tonight. Nate, Mr. Noodle, Avalon, Kane, anybody else that's just uh, in stream hanging out. I appreciate y'all. And I hope to see you again. What is today? Today is Tuesday. So our next night streaming should be Thursday. Uh, we'll be playing another PS2 game of some sort. So, thank you again, and have a good night, everybody. Bye-bye. Okay, well. It doesn't really matter if we pick it up if we just uh, die instantly after.